Now on the racetrack, car number five, W out of Mechanicsburg. This is Lucas Wolf. Wolf in the Allenbach number five W car. Now he's got the time to beat at 13.567. 13.567. Second lap for Wolf. Comes in at 13.650, but he does have the best time so far at Something? 31? 32, I, I can't get no service. 35 I'm seeing. So that should be on the fourth, the fastest in the fourth heat. And how did they get into the lead draw? Finish in the top five. Okay. You'll be, okay. So it's the fastest car in each heat gets in the lead draw and the heat winner, okay. What do you think them guys did to go better there? The, the, the track? I, we, I think you got to make better traction. Better traction. Like the 11 doesn't go like out of control, but just more more into it, just smoother, straighter. Right. Than uh, most of the other cars that make it happen, I, I thought. No, we started with one in, one out in the rear, and that's what we ran in the time trial. I just took a half out of the left front and, and gave you some more gap on the bumper. Is all I did. It's hard to get me. It's hard to get more than two inches of gap with a tall bumper, so I had to go the short one. Well, we could try some more right rear weight if you think I don't help it. Go forward or not, or don't you think it will? I tell you what, let, let, just let's just move that left rear wheel out. That seems to be helping us every time we do that. Half. Yeah. Let's go half out on that and uh, drop the air on both of them, and then we'll we'll race it like. That. Slippy. Yeah, but I just, don't, I just don't get the right rear charged up enough. You know what I mean? I'm too tight rolling when I get, like, I go to get in the three and I'm just tight. I can't get turned around it, but I don't get, I don't get this going enough to get there and get me, like, whip me around or whatever. Right. It's the same thing over here. Like, I just don't, because as soon as I get up to it, when I go to straighten out, then I just kind of do this type of thing, and then I end up tight and high and wide on exit with two. Like, so either I'm, I'm not... My, my timing of it all isn't right, or you know, I, but I'm just I just can't get that thing up and alive and hit something and drive around. Even if I go to get off to like run in the bottom there, like I stop and I'm like here, and then I feel like I got to turn over. Right. Like, yep. You, you know. Yep. You have to just, slow down to keep it to turn. I have like. to I have to like slow yep, down, yep. turn, yep. and then get going. Yep. Again. Yep. Uh, Do you think do you think that's too soft? I don't know. I mean, very well could be. I, I don't. I, I don't. I don't say that it's a. I don't think I'm too tight. I'm too tight because I'm slow. Right. Yep. You're not, slowing not, down not to keep it to turn. Yeah. Uh, do you think that? Do you think the right rear? Do you think the left front bar might be too stiff and it's sticking this too much? Like it not allowing you to turn? Maybe it just it definitely doesn't. You know, it doesn't. Yeah, yeah. When you're on the throttle when you're on the throttle it won't turn. No, I don't yeah. I don't I don't get a good consistent thing on the straightaway that I feel like I'm charging in the enter. I'm like uh, I'm flat and I'm turning all with the front 
Oh, the front tires. Until I gather, until I do that and gather that up, I'm, I, it takes me too much time to do it, and I'm, I'm, I'm too slow. Right, I'm I get it. Let's do, let's find me a nine seven five for the left front. Okay, you want to just go to a thousand? I'm saying it's not. I'm just, I'm just saying it's not a thousand now. Okay, you it want is, to go to. That, how much? How much is that on the pounds? What, what would this one be? 30 pounds more. Yeah, it'd be 503. Well, 40 pounds ought to be enough to make a difference, so we'll just go to 1,000. Lucas will slide to the top side, try to stay in front of the 11 car. Buddy Kofoy dips to the low side as they go in three and four. And Kofoy will lead lap number one, Wolf second. Followed by Dietrich in third. Dietrich looks to the low side. Gets a bite off that second turn, but Wolf stays in front. Now Dietrich to the low side, pulls the slider in three and four. And he's got second by a foot or two at the line. So, no point out front. Dietrich in second. Lucas Wolf running in third. Cootie is in fourth.
Lucas. Well, I'm tight. Tight. You know what I mean? I don't react. I get hikey in the right front, and I'm just, I'm just, it would jump balance to be some, but I'm tight. I can't react, and I, I don't rotate. Like every time I get into something, I just can't get the thing turned. I'm off. I, I just end up on the right front field. Let it set down some more. Well, but see, I already feel like I'm hiking the right front. That's the thing. You see what okay. I'm saying? Like, I'm yeah. not. Like, if I just come out of here and I hit the throttle, it's just fucking like no stuff. Like, I'm, that's what I'm saying. Like, so I do this, and I get an unbalance, and I do this. But yet, I'm not like. It just, it just, this isn't alive. And I feel like I'm too much twisty like this. You know, I, I just don't set down and, and, and go. What about so, like? I, once I get out and get going, they're running around. I'm like, basically, I can maintain the same speed as other people. Every time that there's somebody in front of me, especially in the air, man, I just can't get the fuck turned. Right. It just, I just get the ear, and then, then, to, and then, like when I was running there, I'm not good enough to be up, like up, down, and coming, you know, driving back down. Like I go in, and then I just end up doing the thing up, the, up, up across the track. That's what I feel. Yeah. Well, what, what do you think would happen if I just lower the whole front end some? I mean, it's worth to try something, whatever. I just don't have a good. I'm definitely not good around other cars, you know what I'm saying? Like, if I get close to somebody, I'm dead. Yeah. And I'd say once I get out and get going there, I'm the same fucking speed as everybody else, but I don't know. Yep. Does it look like that to you? Yeah, so you're better on the bottom, I think, if you can do it, right? See, I'm just, like, compared to, like, Freddie there or something, he's up a lane, and he's up driving on Right. Like, I just can't yep. get turned, like, I can't get to that. Yep. Like, I go in low, and then it's lower and flatter, obviously, that's, that's, so I slide across. But like if I go in the middle, I'm just going to slide the same distance that I'm already up. Right. Yeah. Around. And you can be tighter on the bottom and still run around, right? I mean, that's what if I, I turn. Yeah. If, if I turn, turn. I just that's a, it just doesn't respond to one to turn. Wow. Wow. Back out. Code 40 pulls the slider and one and two. And uh, Dietrich gets through. Somehow squeezes between the 11 car and the outside wall. And Dietrich hangs on to the race lead. Lucas Wolf has got by Reamer up to third. And again, Dietrich squeezes by on the top side of two. That cost Buddy Code 40 some ground. And Lucas Wolf a strong third, Raymer fourth. Lucas Wolf with some new life on the restart. Five laps to go. Dietrich followed by Kofoy, Wolf, and Raymer. They're one through four. Moody in fifth, Campbell sixth, Doris running seventh. Then it's Boyd fifth, Billy Dietrich in that order. 